For the next couple days, Mom makes me stay home from school. On the third day, I start to get restless. I'm sick of being sick. Outside my house, a cruel wind blows leaves off our beautiful tree. To pass the time, I download some augmented reality games from the Netgear store. In the first game, my bed is besieged by a horde of tiny soldiers riding tiny horses. I build walls around myself and start frantically mining gold so I can buy upgrades for my catapults. But no matter what I do, the little invaders keep coming, pouring into my room from every nook and cranny. It gets too intense, so I quit. In the next game, I have to catch jewels that fall from the ceiling and organize them into piles. It's pretty fun. But whenever you get a power-up, the jewels start flashing like strobe lights, which makes me feel queasy for some reason. I finally settle on Puffy Pets, a game where you groom cats and dogs and other cute animals. Ages six and up. It's my kind of game. I shall call you Ziggy, because your tail looks like a zigzag. Amy. One of your friends is here. Really? Who? Hey, Zeph. Amy, how are you feeling? Good. A lot better than before. Hey, is that a puffy pet? Yeah. <laughs> My little sister plays that game. That's cool. Um, was there something you needed, or? Oh, I just want to stop by and see how you were doing. I brought you some chicken noodle soup. Thanks. Well, it was I nice had a great of you time to hanging out at. Uh, oh, sorry. You go ahead. <laughs> no, no. What were you going to say? Um, I wanted you to know I had a great time hanging out with you at the pier the other night. I know Cassie only invited me along so you wouldn't feel like a third wheel, but still, I had fun. Oh, yeah. I had fun too. Well, my free period's almost over. I should get back to school. Call me if you need anything. Hopefully I'll see you at school tomorrow. Yeah, um, thanks for the soup. No problem. Well, that was awkward. That was awkward, right? Eventually, I make a full recovery. I'm off to school! Put a jacket on, Amy. It's cold outside. Mom, I'll be fine. Trust me. The weather's changing. And besides, you don't want to get sick again, do you? No. There we are. And here's your lunch. Bye, Mom. <laughs> Have a great day, sweetie. It is cold out here. Hey! Mom, guess what? <gasps> what? It's so cold, I can see my breath! <laughs> it's like I'm smoking. <sighs> There's no smoking allowed in this house, young lady. Even pretend smoking. Now, off to school with you. on the space station, if you could see your breath, it usually meant the life support systems were failing and you were in danger of freezing to death. But here on Earth? Hey mom, all the leaves fell off our tree. Amy, go to school. It feels so good to be healthy and alive and back outside. <laughs> I've been trapped in the house for too long. Mm -hmm. Wow, someone made a big pile of leaves. What a great idea. <laughs> All 
Oliver. He looks like he could use some cheering up, as usual. Nothing. Hello? Earth to Oliver! Come in, Oliver! Amy? Hey! What are you thinking so hard about? What? Sorry, I... I just... Where have you been? Stop, slow down What happened to reality? It's gone upside down I can't escape the gravity So I realign Say that it's all just fine The truth is distance can't erase the inside Cast adrift in seas I do of fear surround me as I 